I don't believe in hiding myself because I think that's too, that's too much effort for me. Theatre has helped with talking with other people that I don't know. I am on the autistic spectrum and that has made communicating a bit difficult. Pink! 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 pink, pink, pink. pink. When you're working with each other, you can't just ignore people and sit by yourself. You have to talk to them. The best way to get ready for acting is to just do weird stuff with people you don't know. I did the youth theatre for, I think, eight years until I got too old and I got kicked out. Guess I just didn't really know what to do with myself. I didn't know if I could do the proper theatre because I still looked really young. And we want to take young people on a journey. So they use theatre as a tool, you know, to draw them out of themselves. We've got an enormous theatre here at the Birmingham Rep. We've got about 80 people employed full-time at the theatre. What I've been doing this week is helping facilitate the young people to create their own play. I get like that excitement before a show, like when you're on a roller coaster and it's just about to go and there's that split second of just, this is actually going to happen, I can't back out. Greetings! I am the Wizard of the Forest. And before you ask, no, I didn't go to Hogwarts. Have you all written down what you want to write? Your wish is for the wizard. Indeed, Arena, let's get started, shall we? Mm, yes, as now you probably. The Driver's Seat Initiative knows that confidence and individuality are two of the most important skills that a young person can take forward. Because no matter what area of life you go into and what area of work you go into, you need to have the confidence to go and do that. When I'm with my mates at the theatre, rehearsing a play, there's nothing better than that to me. It's a great feeling when it's done and you sit down and you relax and you just look at each other and you just say, we did it. <laughs>